Hey everyone, athletes and sports fans, today, I need to talk about something that's really got me concerned. Valentina Petrillo, a transgender woman, is about to compete in the Paralympics, representing Italy in the women's 200 meters and 400 meters races. This move by the Italian Paralympic Federation and the International Paralympic Committee seems like a big miss when it comes to fairness and sportsmanship. We've always celebrated inclusivity and equality, but there's a big difference between being inclusive and messing with the basic idea of fair competition. Sports are supposed to be about everyone having a fair shot, without any built-in advantages or disadvantages. Even though Valentina Petrillo identifies as a woman, she still has some biological advantages from male puberty. These include muscle mass, bone density, and lung capacity that don't just disappear with hormone therapy. So, letting her compete in the women's events means she has a leg up over her female competitors. This decision not only ignores the hard work and dedication of female athletes but also sets a troubling precedent. It basically says that biological differences don't matter and that women have to compete against people who might have an unfair advantage. This could seriously mess with the spirit of women's sports, which have fought hard for equal opportunities and recognition. Women have worked incredibly hard to get where they are and allowing transgender women to compete against them could be seen as a major slap in the face. The guidelines from the International Olympic Committee, which allow transgender women to compete in women's sports after hormone therapy, don't really address the lingering biological advantages. It's time for the sports world to come together and set up clear, evidence-based rules that ensure fair play for everyone, no matter their gender identity. To wrap it up, letting Valentina Petrillo compete in the Paralympics as a woman feels like a major misstep. It sends a worrying message to female athletes everywhere and could undermine the core of fair competition. We need to stand up for a level playing field and make sure political correctness doesn't mess with the fairness that's supposed to be at the heart of sports.